Hi everyone, my name is Sean from Investism and I wanted to share some Katie information with you. Around the end of 2015, Katie released a set of application accelerators which are ready to use apps so that you can deploy more solutions and impact your business in less time. These apps provide pre-built solutions in an easy to consume format and can be implemented quickly by configuring the information specific to your environment. At this point in time, there are 12 application accelerators available, but from what I understand, there are many more on the way. Another item which comes with the K2 application accelerators is the K2 Workdesk. The K2 Workdesk provides a single entry point into the application accelerators that are available in your environment, as well as allow you to add your own solution links to the Workdesk. Today's section is around the K2 Workdesk, where to get it, how to install it, and how to configure it. So let's go with where to get it. Firstly, you have to go to the URL, K2 Application Accelerators. I'll give the specific URL in the uh, detail below. And you, once you have, you're on this page, you'll see the link for the K2 Workdesk to download that, as well as links to the downloads for all the uh, 12 application accelerators. Like I said, today's session is about the K2 Workdesk. So we're gonna click on the download button and you need to read the end user license agreement and once you're happy with that you click on i accept that you accept the end user license agreement the download should then start shortly and i'm going to save mine and specific location download scale to application accelerators download the zip file there and it's quick and easy because it's a fairly sh a small uh, solution file once you have the file you would extract that I'm going to extract mine and then show you the contents of the file. It's two PDFs. Uh, one is the end user license agreement for a refresher in the future if you need to see what you signed your life away with. Um, and then the K2 application accelerator a work desk overview, which gives you instructions on how to install it, how to configure it, what the prerequisites are, etc. Essentially what I'm covering in this section today. Then we have two uh, solution files. Uh, one is uh, the work desk without any links pre-configured and then the second one is uh, the work desk with all uh, the application accelerators uh, links pre-configured but you need, still need to download the individual solutions and deploy them in your environment. Okay so now you've downloaded your uh, application accelerator package unzip the file and you have the contents available. To install the K2 Workdesk is quite easy. You have two options. You can use the K2 package deployment program running it from all programs, K2, Blackpool, etc. Or you can uh, double click on the solution and it will open the K2 package deployment console as well. Um, so it will show you the file that you want to install uh, you can configure the configuration here if you need to s select all the items you need to go, etc. It's fairly uh, straightforward to do this. Click on next. The package deployment tool will then look at what's currently in your environment, look at any conflicts and references that need to be addressed. Um, as you can see, it's picking up some conflicts in my environment because I already have the work desk installed. But uh, you know, it will, if, you, if it's for the brand new installation, you can. Uh, go and it will just be ready for deployment. Uh, I'm not going to click on this because I, I've already got it installed, but your environment you should be able to click on next and it would deploy the item, the solution. Okay, so I'm going to close this and what you would then do is you can go and browse to your uh, application uh, work desk and you would see the following. Now I've got the one installed that's got all uh, the business applications pre-configured already and working and I'll touch on each one of those later. The nice thing about the Workdesk is that you can put all your items together. Let's say you're, you've got your tasks, you click on my tasks, it will open the page with any of the tasks assigned to you. Currently I don't have any. Uh, you can categorize items into applications for employees, uh, business applications for specific to the environment, uh, dashboards, all kinds of stuff like that. To configure that, you would go up to the uh, desk, and it, currently I'm uh, logged in as the Nalex administrator. I can select what I want to do. I can just see there's a task work desk uh, configured with my work list and my team's work list and the dashboards. 
and I can also go to the manage the work desk and this is where you would add all the links that you have available so as you can see I've got three work desks available on my solution and the task work desk the management work desk and the application work desk to manage this you click on manage work desk links it will open the page with all of the configuration for your uh, solutions that you have in your environment it's very easy if there's already something there you need to update something double click on it the item can be edited right here or you can uh, go and click on on an item click on the edit button it does the same thing I can also go and uh, add my own so I can add a new row when I'm at the bottom or I can say I want to add an item and once it goes there uh, this will be my demo item um, and well demo links let's call it demo links there's no form associated with this this is just a heading and um, I don't have an icon but I can uh, just save that so I can go and save and let's go and see what happens if I go to my uh, application work desk it should update with my demo links header there it is and I'll just add another one here it says manage my links I'm gonna go to manage the links go down to my header where's my header demo links there it is I want to add an item in here um, and I would say demo link and I can put the URL in or uh, slash we'll take one of these uh, other ones forms oops form work no. the uh, defect tracking smart form uh, just as a sample it's not a heading it's actually an item we can have uh, the different uh, what you call it uh, icons associated with this um, let's just say it's link there's my link item and this is a thing it say is it a smart form yes it is and this is the the sequence in what it gets displayed so I didn't put a sequence in for my demo link so I'm gonna make this number one so that's the next one in the list and then I'll go and save that and I can refresh it and you'll see my demo links heading and my demo link that's in here and what I'll do is I'll go back to my application work desk and there you'll see my demo link item Okay, so now we've uh, downloaded it and installed and configured uh, a work desk and I thought I'd just do a quick recap of what it is. It's a solution to give you access to multiple of your smart form solutions or other solutions and links in your environment. Uh, it's a central place for people to go to. The nice thing is you can have multiple work desks. For example, I've got an application work desk at the moment with all my applications that I've got. And I also have a task work desk, which is just related to the work that's assigned to me or to my team and some workflows around uh, the dashboards uh, for those. Uh, you click on that, it updates the information. Uh, on my system, I currently don't have much information, so nothing much to stay. Um, the work desk is used to manage itself, so you, you can manage how many work desks you want from the work desk environment. You click on the manage links to update the links. It's quite easy. You have to specify a display name for your link. The URL it needs to go to. Is it a heading or is it a link? What icon do I need to associate with it? Is it going to a smart form or not? And what is the sequence I need to show these things in? Um, and that's essentially it. The prerequisites, like I said, is that you need K2 Black for 4.6.11 as well as K2 Smart Forms 4611 and Smart Forms 4611 Control Pack. Um, the nice thing is here is we're using standard out of the box K2 functionality uh, to provide this work desk to you and it's a quick and easy get up and go solution to have a small portal uh, with all your business applications in one central place. Thank you very much for your time.